As a Shopify store owner, setting up your Shopify checkout page as per your requirement is a mind-boggling task, particularly if you have many queries on customizing the checkout page's style and text as per your requirements. In this video, we will cover all the possible methods to customize and change the checkout text of your Shopify store with some live examples and scenarios. Note that this video is not based on completely customizing the checkout as Shopify allows complete customization if you are on a Shopify Plus plan. To set up the checkout customizations, go to Shopify Settings, Checkout, click on Customize Checkout. Upload a background image for the banner. You can display an image at the top of the checkout page. This image can be either about your brand or any announcement or a message. Under Checkout section, in the Banner section, click Upload Image or select an image that you have already uploaded to your library. Click Save. You will now see the banner appear. Add a logo to the checkout page. You can add your store logo to the checkout pages. If you are using a banner image, then the logo appears on top of it. You can position your logo on the left, right, or center of the banner area on the checkout pages. Add a background image or color to the main content area. You can add a background image or color to the main content area of the checkout pages. Add a background color or image. If you are adding an image, then click Upload Image or select an image that you have already uploaded to your library. Smaller images repeat vertically and horizontally on the background like tiles. Click Save. You can edit the background image and enter the alternate text using the Preview and Edit option. If you are adding a color, then click the box beside Background Color to open a color picker. Then choose a color or enter a hexadecimal code. Change the color of the form fields. You can change the color of the fields to make them either white or transparent. You might want to make the fields transparent so a background image shows through. In the main content area section, click the form fields drop down to select the color you want. Click Save. Add a background image or color to the order summary. In the order summary section, Add a background color or image. If you are adding a color, then click the box beside background color to open a color picker, then choose a color or enter a hexadecimal code. Click Save. Change the font on the checkout page. In the checkout section, scroll down to the typography area. Click the headings drop down or the body drop down and then select a font. Click Save. Change button and accent colors on the checkout page. In the colors section, click the color box beside accents, buttons, or errors to open a color picker. Then choose a color or enter a hexadecimal code. Click Save. There are also some checkout customizations that can be done from Shopify's admin. Customer Contact Method You can allow the customer to enter either phone number or email or just the email based on your choice. Login You can also prompt the shopper to log in to their account and check out using the link shown below the contact information. This will help you maintain loyalty and run successful repeated business. Checkout page form. 
you can change some of the fields on your checkout pages so that they are required, optional, or hidden. For example, if some customers abandon their cards because they don't want to provide their phone number during an online checkout, then the phone number can be set to optional. You can ignore company name from the form to avoid confusions, which still is a mostly asked question in the Shopify community. Here, for this video, I'm making a small change that makes shipping address mandatory to checkout, so this will reflect in the checkout page of Shopify. Now, moving to the tipping section. You can collect tips from your customers with thresholds based on order percentage. This tipping option will appear at the payment page and reflect in the order total. You can also minimize it using the hide option as shown here. You can run scripts in HTML, JavaScript, VBScript, etc. to make changes to the order status page. Here, I have written a small HTML code to display on the order status page. You can run scripts of any third-party app to perform specific tasks or actions. For example, I have added a script of Pikisi, the pickup delivery date app, to capture the date and time selected from the app to be displayed at the checkout as shown here. Select an app to use on your post-purchase page. After installing and configuring a checkout app, you need to select that app to use on the post-purchase page in your checkout settings. We have selected the Sell Easy Upsell and Cross-Sell app to display the post-purchase offer at checkout page. You can also change the app that you want to use in your checkout settings. Let's see how to do a direct text change. This is to change the existing text of Shopify checkout pages. Imagine there is a situation where you want to convey additional information along with existing text of the checkout page. Let's say you want the customer to add the sender's contact details in the contact information when they are sending surprise gifts. In that case, you can edit the text contact information as per your requirements using these steps. Go to Shopify settings, check out in accounts and scroll down to manage checkout language. In the search box, search for contact information and then edit the existing text with your desired text. Now, go to the checkout page and check if the changes are reflected correctly. Now, this will effectively convey the message to customers who are sending gifts to recipients. Now, here's what you should note. Do not change the other texts as it might affect the other checkout pages. For example, there is the same word contact information which appears in the thank you page which resides in the checkout pages of Shopify. So if you change the other text, then it will reflect in the thank you page, which makes no sense. This is a one-click checkout page that makes the checkout easier by reducing the number of steps and stages to visit after each and every update. You can also see the checkout button is renamed and styled as per the customer's requirements and the shoppers are secured with McAfee Secure. All these links and images are rendered with the help of Shopify Plus Plan Adaptability. Hope this video was helpful. Like, share and subscribe to this channel for more Shopify tips and tricks and we will see you again in another video.